All right, today I'm gonna to be building a front splitter for the Miata. Not exactly aerodynamic in the front, especially with the bottom tray removed. So we're gonna build something for that. I'm gonna be using plywood and gonna be milling some aluminum for the mounts out of my uh, 3D printed CNC machine. So let's get started. So it turns out the screws that I was going to use to mount this splitter were this one, this one, this one, this one, and this one. But I knew from the beginning that this one was stripped out and I tried drilling it out and missed the hole. So these two screws here were the mount for the sway bar. Both of the heads on those broke off when I tried to loosen them. It's just rusted out inside there. I tried to pry off the sway bar mount and I just realized it's actually welded on there. And so I'm gonna have to drill that out to get this bracket off of the frame. And then maybe I'll be able to get to the screws and drill them out the rest of the way and weld in the new captive uh, nut in there. So yeah, this turned out to be a big pain. All right, so I managed to get the old brackets off. Now I just gotta drill these holes out and weld them in and do that. So my holes are drilled out. Now I'm just gonna grind the corners off this nut just so it's a close gap for my weld and we'll get it welded up. Okay, so I've got these welded in here. Still some cleanup to do and paint, but my dilemma is now I've got the stock mounts that I could bolt back up in there, but I've heard these are pretty weak. It's kind of a thin material. And if I mount my splitter right here, there's these bumps that kind of get in the way. So I'm gonna fabricate my own new mounts. So here is the new design all flattened out here. Uh, basically the same kind of shape as the previous mounts, but I'm gonna be using a uh, heavier gauge steel. So I just printed this on Fusion on a 2D drawing, one-to-one uh, -one scale, and flattened it out using the sheet metal tool. If you want me to make a video on how I did that, uh, let me know in the comments. But I'm just gonna cut this out here and make some cuts here, bend the metal to the right shape, and then weld it all in place and get it all strong. Then when we'll get it mounted up on the car. All right, so I got both of the brackets made. They're not super pretty, but they match the shape of the original brackets, and they're a lot stronger. I ended up using the same mounting holes as the stock. Just welded a nut on the back there. So everything fits up right. I just gotta get these painted, and hopefully they'll look a little bit better after we get done with that.
Okay, I've got X, Y, and Z zero set. I just need to hit go, and we're gonna CNC our first aluminum part. got the splitter mounts all mounted up. I ended up putting five holes down here all at different angles so that I can adjust the actual splitter angle just with using this one bolt and that will give me some adjustability as far as how much downforce I want to uh, have with this splitter. Right now I've just got it set on the level with the ground setting. Um, we'll test that out and then if I ever want to change it, I just change this bolt out and get a little bit more downforce. 